All right, guys, in this video, as promised, I want to take a deep dive into Open Doors earnings, and they are absolutely fantastic. So stick around. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me for another video. I'm Richard Allen. I do this every Monday through Friday here on the Tip Ranks YouTube channel, at least two videos per day. So please subscribe if you aren't subscribed already. I would love for you to be a part of the journey. It's been fantastic, super, super fun. A lot of informative videos that we post here on this channel, including this one, hopefully. So if you find some value from this video, let me know down in the comments. But we're gonna talk about Open Door Technologies. They had a fantastic quarter last quarter and blew out numbers, and I mean blew out numbers. Um, and uh, we're gonna talk about that. The first thing I wanna do is I wanna read a statement from the CEO of Open Door because it gives you just a little snippet of what's going on and then the last statement that he makes is absolutely fantastic so okay bear with me here here it says in the second quarter of 2021 we acquired a record 8,494 homes generated revenue of 1.2 billion and delivered adjusted EBITDA of 25.6 million representing growth of 136 percent in homes acquired 59 percent in revenue and nearly $28 million in adjusted EBITDA compared to the first quarter. This strong outperformance is further evidence of the seismic shift in consumer demand towards the modern real estate experience we are pioneering. Based on our current momentum, we are operating today at a second half revenue run rate that is on track to meet the 2023 target we provided at the time of our December listing. Wow. So they're on pace to hit the 2023 revenue target already this year. That's absolutely fantastic. They're a couple years ahead. So this is, this is, I was really, really bullish on this company before. I'm even more bullish on this company now. The last video I made on Open Door, we talked about, uh, I, I think anything under $20 is a fantastic buy. And I mean, fantastic buy for the short term or even the long term. So keep that in mind that's my personal opinion obviously do your own research as well but i think anything under twenty dollars for open door is absolutely fantastic now in the spirit of that statement okay the statement that eric Wu made where he said this strong outperformance is further evidence of the seismic shift in consumer demand toward the modern real estate experience we are pioneering i want to play to you my favorite commercial from open door so stick around, it's about 30 seconds, and then we'll get back into the video, okay? Imagine if the first ever way we did things just became the way. Send. If we all just said, yeah, that kind of works, and left it there. Yeah! That would be ridiculous, right? Well, that's what happened with the home selling process, and it needed a change. So we at Open Door decided to invent a whole new way. One where you sell directly to us and sidestep the old way altogether. Sell your home the new fashioned way. Open door. Yeah, absolutely love that com that commercial. It's my favorite commercial by far. And the reason I wanted to play it for you is because this sector of the economy, the real estate economy is huge. We're talking trillions of dollars, north of 10 trillion, uh, almost 15 trillion dollars. I mean, it's a massive, massive market and it is ripe for disruption. It really, really is. And it hasn't changed in so long aside from you know zillow listing things online and real estate you know uh, uh, professionals being able to market directly to you online and things like that but the home buying process and selling process hasn't really changed much and that's what open door is trying to do so i absolutely love that commercial it gives you some good insight into the archaic nature of real estate and that open door is it is really doing some fantastic stuff now i want to take a further deep dive into the numbers here real quick for you guys again revenue 1.2 billion they beat by 110 million dollars fantastic beat there um expanded to 39 markets at the end of the second quarter 2021 with 12 new market launches purchased 8,494 homes again up 136 percent versus the first quarter 2021 they grew inventory balance uh, to 2.7 billion that's up 224 percent 
versus the first quarter 2021. They ended the quarter with contracts to acquire an additional 8,158 homes, representing $3 billion in value. So they're going to have over $5 billion, almost $6 billion in real estate. Fantastic there. Third quarter 2021 revenue guidance of $1.8 billion to $1.9 billion versus $1.62 billion consensus. And third quarter 2021 adjusted EBITDA guidance of 15 to 25 million. So fantastic numbers, fantastic outlook. Again, these numbers, these numbers for revenue are what they projected for 2023. So this is absolutely fantastic. I, like I said, I love Open Door. The analysts love Open Door as well. I want to take a peek at what the analysts have to say. Again, this has a moderate buy based on four analyst ratings with an average upside of 93%. But if we scroll down and actually look at these most recent ratings, they're from three months ago, two months ago, and last month. So I expect after these or this earning report here, that we'll see some new either reiterations or new price targets and ratings come in over the next few days to few weeks. Um, so I'll keep an eye out for those and report back to you guys again. This is one of my favorite companies. I hope you guys like it as well. I know the last time I made a video about Open Door, uh, you guys were super, super interested in it as well. Um, and for good reason. It is a fantastic company. I think it it is has a, a, a great opportunity to potentially even 5x from here over the next five to 10 years, um, potentially more, depending on how the overall market goes. So guys, thank you so much for tuning, tuning into another video with me again. I'm here Monday through Friday, two videos per day. So if you aren't subscribed already, please go ahead and do that. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one.